Hey y'all, it's Liz. Okay, I'm back with another recreated look, and it's um, from uh, Makeup by Jennifer, and I'll leave her link somewhere down in here. Um, and it's also using the Naked Palette by Urban Decay. If you don't have the Naked Palette, <clears throat> you could basically use um, any matte black with um, a shimmery kind of brown, dark brown. Matter of fact, you could use... Um, um, Too Faced has a smoky palette. Um, you can use your 120 palette or your uh, 88 matte palette or your 88 palette. <laughs> um, there's a lot of dupes for these colors. Um, so yeah, if you don't have a naked palette, then just use what you have and you can still recreate this look. Um, I went kind of um, plain on the lips, didn't want to play them up too much because of my eyes. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys um, will enjoy the tutorial that's coming up. And again, this is a recreated look from Makeup by Jennifer. And I will leave her link up here, down here somewhere, and down in the down bar so you can check her out. Um, so yeah, um, I love doing these recreated looks um, with stuff that I have. And it's, it just goes to show you that anybody can do it. Um, I know some people say that, oh, well, your skin tone, you shouldn't wear this color or you shouldn't wear that color, but um, it's all about art and about beauty, and um, I really think that if it's blue, you can wear it, you know, it doesn't matter what color you are, as long as you wear it correctly. I don't wear blue. <laughs> I do sometimes, but anyways, this is... Um, just a really nice smoky eye if you want to go out for dinner or to clubs or something like that. Um, you can wear this look. Uh, on a daily basis, like probably not. Now, you probably wouldn't. But if I worked, if I had a J-O-B, a real job, um, I would probably wear this to work. But that's just me. All right. Well, um, I hope you guys enjoy the tutorial that's coming up. And until my next video, yeah, deuces. All right. Check this look out. I think you might like it. All right. See you guys later. Bye. Hey, y'all, if you're ready to get started with this recreated look, um, I've done a look like this before, but um, I haven't. Um, I didn't use the Naked palette. Uh, Makeup by Jennifer has done this look, and I'm just going to recreate the look because I thought it was very, very pretty. Um, the only difference is um, I primed my lid with Urban Decay Primer Potion. Um, I didn't have a black bean um, jumbo pencil, but I do have a dark brown, which looks like this, and this is what I used instead. I know. I could have used um, a black... Um, like black track fluid line or something, but I decided just to use that one. Um, so the first color that she went in with was Creep, which is this one here. And that's the one I'm going to go in with. Um, so I'm going to put that on my brush, like so. And I'm just going to pat that onto my lid. Um, and I'm probably not going to put too much right here. I'll probably use a uh, just a regular matte black right in the inner portion of my eye because my eye um, seems like it gets irritated when I use like anything with a little bit of the the shimmery stuff in it. So just to be safe, I'm just going to pat this um, starting right here, and um, on the inner corner, I'm going to put another color a matte black color there. So I'm just going to pat this all over my lid and um, put on a matte black in the inner corner. Okay, now that I put the um, creep on, I went in with in my inner corner with um, a matte black from the iHeart matte palette from Wet n Wild and I did go above the crease just slightly so um, I'm just gonna blend this all out with a clean brush and 
and it looks kind of messy right now but it's okay because we're gonna put another color up there and then we're gonna do some blending just like so and when you're doing a smoky eye um, you can use tape but on this look I decided not to so Okay, the next color that we're going to go in with um, is Dark Horse, which is this brown here. We're going to take that and put that on our, um, we're going to work that on our crease and above. And just like so, and work it um, towards our brow bone not all the way up because we're going to do a highlight color and I'm also putting in um, Buck um, a, like a really light brown but just like so and you're going to do that on the other side also okay now that we've put on dark horse we're going to go in with um, Buck which is this light brown here you could use naked also but I'm just gonna take buck and apply that between the top of my brow or underneath my brow and um, on top of that dark horse and I'm just gonna kinda fade these colors together just like so then I'm going to go in with um, with Vanilla by MAC, which is this one. And I'm just going to use that as my highlight color. Um, like I said, you could use Virgin um, if you wanted to, but it's kind of shimmery to me. So I just want to, you know, just something that's not as shimmery and that I could blend in with, um, with Buck. just like so and then just kind of blend these colors together okay and I don't have any foundation or anything on yet I'm gonna put that on when I get done doing my eyes. Okay. And if you lose any of that, that color from that buck, you can go back in and reapply it if you need to. And just continue to blend. So they kind of look like they go together, not like they're separated. Okay, just like so. All right, I'll be right back. Okay, everybody, I'm back with the final look. I know it kind of looks really, really dark, um, but then again, different skin tones, it shows up a little different. Um, but I do like it just to go out to eat dinner or, you know, uh, maybe to go clubbing, uh, which I don't do, but um, I think it's a very pretty, smoky, sexy kind of look. Um, you could pair it up with a, um, a red lip. It's just that there was so much going on with these eyes that I decided to go kind of um, a neutral color. Um, not really neutral. I used um, Night Moth by MAC to line it, and then um, I kind of... Um, blotted and smeared it in and then on top of that I used um, So Pearly 725 from um, the Maybelline I think it's Maybelline yeah color sensation looks like this and just kinda dotted it right there in the center yeah and uh, that's it so um, this is my take on the recreated look from um, Makeup by Jennifer. 
Um, there's a lot of tutorials out there using the Naked palette, um, but I really liked um, her um, her smoky, sexy eyes. Um, so I, I decided to try this out. All right, well, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial, and um, I'll be back with some more created looks. Recreated looks, not created looks, but recreated looks from someone else. All right, well, you guys have a great night, and I will talk to you soon. Deuces, y'all. Bye.